Not a soul in sight. Tonga is in lockdown, and it is a first. Shops, supermarkets, it, it's close. It's a ghost town here in the Kualofa. On Wednesday, the government rolled out an open-ended lockdown, for they had just received word of COVID cases among dock workers. Strict border closures since 2020 have meant that Tonga has been nearly entirely COVID-free, with only one case in two years. With a desperate need for international aid following last month's disastrous volcano and tsunami, officials' fears were confirmed that COVID would be brought along with the help. Tonga has been hit uh, uh, with, with, with two uh, disasters. The one is, the, of course, the eruption. And the second one is the discovery of the uh, of, of COVID-19 cases. Ships from France, Australia, New Zealand, Japan and China have been delivering much needed fresh water and medicine in contactless deliveries. One Australian ship, the HMAS Adelaide, reported over 20 COVID cases on board. But officials say the cases at Tonga's wharf do not seem to be linked with the ships. Booster shots are being administered to the population to try and avoid an outbreak. While the majority of Tongans are vaccinated, officials fear that the remote locations of some of the islands and limited medical resources could be a recipe for even more tragedy if COVID spreads.